Good afternoon. We're here in the garage. Uh, just finished up a project trying to make a light for my Craftsman snowblower. Uh, has a canopy on it. And uh, unfortunately, this model in particular does not have a stator that uh, usually there'd be an extra wire down here where you could actually wire up a light if you wanted one, or sometimes it would come with a light right there. Uh, this one, again, did not come with that particular part. So therefore, because I bought it used, I didn't really have much choice. But I still wanted to add a light because snow blowing in the dark is not the most fun. Uh, I got a 48 watt, quote unquote, uh, one of those Chinese square four inch LEDs mounted to a hole already on this uh, bracketry that came with the canopy. And oddly enough, many of you have probably seen this style simple automotive switch comes with just about every cheap light fixture kit you can get for automotive uh, type applications uh, from your auto zone or whatever. It comes with the, the cheap lights that they sell as kits. Um, I was able to wire up a battery, a 12 volt, seven amp hour. This bracket in particular will actually fit a 12 amp hour battery up to if I decide to. Uh, and I've just got it set up pretty simply. I spliced in a charge, trickle charge cable so that uh, when it's not in use or if it has been used, you can just charge it up. Should get about an hour, hour and a half runtime minimum out of this setup. Uh, that's assuming that that's drawing the full 48 watts, which I highly doubt it is, uh, being a Chinese light. And just to give you an idea what it looks like, uh, I'll switch lights up. And there's a nice good beam off to the side of the chute so it doesn't get in the way too badly when you cycle it's left to right. Uh, the beam will get wider obviously as it goes forward. And I was worried in particular about the, the handle getting in the way or the trigger getting in the way of this bracket. So I actually cut the bracket to get it out of the way and there's more than enough hand relief now. And uh, if any of you guys are looking for what that particular battery bracket is that came with the little foam insert, there it is. Clam battery bracket kit. One eight, or sorry, one zero eight eight two nine. Uh, very simple. Just cut my own holes and actually mounted it right up off to the side uh, onto this little br side bracket here uh, that holds the plastic and the cross brace for the entire controls. Hope that's helpful to somebody. Uh, I know not all these machines come with stators and some are ancient and don't have the ability to add uh, uh, lights that will run off the machine. But uh, hey, if I could help one person, I did my job. Have a great day.